Great weather, a little sticky, a little tough sometimes on the makeup, but we've got the pros for all of that. And joining us, we have uh, Anna Maria, who's uh, with uh, Makeup Forever. Great to have you here. Wonderful. I actually didn't know the company was based out of uh, Montreal, so yes, head offices yes, in Montreal. We, we have yeah. some wonderful uh, guests joining mm -hmm. us, uh, all coming in from Montreal to be able to help us out with this. Wonderful things that we're seeing. And by the way, your colors, all of you, look fantastic. Can Thank we hit you. on color trends right now? Because I just yes, want to sure. see some of these colors that we're seeing. Well, uh, you know, it's summer, so we want to have some more flashy colors. We can try a little bit more. It's going to have more fun, more poppy colors. So, for example, here, uh, we are very, uh, it's very trendy to have more flash colors. Like we have a fuchsia, which I'm wearing right now, or on Lindsay here, we're having a nice peachy color. Or, for, for example, for Ida, we decided to go more on the eyes, for example. So we try something a bit more teal or more green on our eyes to just make a nice contrast with their skin color. They're beautiful combinations, and it's nice. I think people are going a little, they're, they're going a little over, giving themselves a little bit of that challenge and trying some of these yeah, colors, which is great. Even if it's one thing that they're doing, that they're try. trying it. Uh, I'm looking at your lip color right now, mm -hmm. and it looks amazing, but I'm thinking, okay, how quick is it going to come off? What are we looking at? And I'm, I'm excited to see our white mug yeah. test today. Well, I'm wearing regular makeup, so this one is not gonna be waterproof. It's gonna transfer on the mug. But here, Lindsay, she has her aqua rouge, which are just here. So when we're gonna do the mug test, it's not gonna transfer. Okay, so there's a big difference. Can you go through the difference of what we are seeing with regular makeup and then what you're referring to as the, as the waterproof? Mm -hmm. Well, when we're saying waterproof, this means that it's going to be really, uh, it was tested in hard conditions. So you really can submerge the makeup underwater. At Makeup Forever, when we claim that our makeup is waterproof, we mean that we tested underwater for up to five hours. Okay, so you've got someone going underwater, you've got someone swimming. This isn't yes. just that they get caught in the yes, rain. It's not, okay. it's not about just sweating yeah. or being caught in the rain. You can really swim, go to the pool, go to the beach with our products. Wow, that is amazing. Okay, so let's see this being done. Can we do okay. it? Okay. White mug. So there, you can see. It really does work. Yeah. And on Lindsay, there's absolutely nothing. That's impressive. And that's quite the color, too, that you would think that some of that might be going. Yeah. And it's, I guess, kissable, too, right? Mm -hmm. that's, that, that's the key to that as well. You're seeing that in the mascaras. In the, Where do you see that line of waterproof going? Well, all of their makeup, from their foundation to the blush, to lipstick, to mascara, to eyebrows, to eyeshadow, this is all, all, all waterproof. So you can do a whole makeup with only waterproof products. Okay, then I'm going to ask you, great, so you can go in a pool, then what happens in the shower when you're actually trying to, if it, if it can last up to five hours underwater, how are we getting it off? Because sometimes then you find that you're really pulling at the skin to remove it. Well, for sure if you're using only water and some soap, it might be a little bit more difficult to remove. So this is where you want to have the appropriate cleanser. So for example, here we have the Sun Size, which is our waterproof makeup remover, which is made of cotton seed oil. Uh, and still, if you use it on your skin, it's not going to leave an oily, greasy feeling because it's a mild oil. So it's going to remove everything, but still you don't have this nasty, greasy feeling mm -hmm. afterwards. So that's what you want to be able to use exactly. if you're using these types of products. Can I go through a little bit more here? Yes. Because what are we seeing here? So here we have the Aqua Shadow. It's our eyeshadow in a stick form. And here we have the Aqua Cream, which is kind of very similar. Can I open this? I want to see what you're yes. talking about. Eyeshadow in a stick form. How do you do this? Yes. So you have here your shadow, you mm -hmm. can apply it directly on your eyes or maybe using, for example, your fingers or brush and then applying to sheer it up. That's it. It's mm -hmm. yeah, is it. Is it easier for people to, to, to use it like that? And when we're looking at, there's so many different techniques that professional makeup mm -hmm. artists are able to do, which the general public can't really quite figure out how to do. Well, using creamy products like mm -hmm. those are pretty easy to use because they're more easy to blend, for example. Mm -hmm. The only thing that you want to keep in mind when you're using uh, Acura products is that use very sheer, um, you want to uh, put very sheer layers. If you okay. put too much at once, it's going to look a little bit um, like skill fish, for example, or the texture is not going to be as nice. So if you want to have a little bit more coverage, just reapply a second thin layer. Great tips uh, from Makeup Forever. These are some wonderful products. Keep that in mind, too, if you're especially looking at the long-lasting and the waterproof uh, aspects to your makeup. Uh, and people can find uh, Makeup Forever where? Uh, well, we can find Makeup Forever Wear exclusive at Sephora. Mm -hmm. So you can either go in Sephora stores or you can go on sephora.ca. Perfect. Perfect. And it really is a wonderful, wonderful line of makeup. Thank you so much.